Hello my friend Bayani here with Bayani Renault. In this video just gonna show you how to do some grout. So we have the tiles up, everything is up and uh, what we're gonna do here, we're just gonna remove all spaces, everything of it and make it nice and clean and then go through the grout nice and easy. So this is uh, the step we're gonna take just to show you guys. Just for you guys to see, this is the way it's supposed to look. All the space is clean and broken, so now we just have to do the growth nice and easy. Let's get this job done, and then after a few days, we come back and uh, do the caulking like the silicone around it on the corner and around the shower. Uh, we always use the uh, unsanded grout white and then sand it, so mix them for flooring a little bit of. Uh, Unsend it and then more send it. Walls around 50 50. Yeah. Better look. Oh, yeah, you know, bigger areas obviously use the mixer. Yeah. 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 But there is no point with that. It's smaller jobs. My hand is perfectly fine. How about how do you know the consistency? No, it has to be thick, thick. Because those are walls, yeah, and then yeah. if you go too much water, one, it, it doesn't stick to the wall, and then with flooring, when you wipe up, it's it's not like cover perfect grout yeah. lines. Yeah, like it, I'm, I'm leaving that for five, ten minutes, then uh, remix, then it's ready. With this, probably shower, so I would go with one one wall at a time, then yeah. quickly wash it. Mm -hmm. I really put grout between top and then tiles because when you do that you yeah, have this problem squeaking problem here on so better not just just leave it and put later silicone better than putting grout like with corners same thing but like one of the quick quick rock job you don't really put grout in the corners here yeah. so you do one wall clean it up and then next one the next one yeah, yeah. probably maybe in next because corners are already down maybe two at the same time yeah. if you wait too long then the grout it's getting hard. So you mix the growth from floor and wall that way is a uh, holds very strong and holds very hard. The, the regular grout set faster, right? Eh? Yeah, after, yeah. you know, like two hours and so almost, you know, you can start even walking with that. I have you know a few touch-ups here, but then at the end of I want to finish all those four units and then come quickly and then and adjust those little spots here. Yeah. But that's that's good enough. Sometimes when it's dry and, and with smaller tiles, mosaic, usually there are some spots where the ground is missing. And then you you see like I use the uh, 
gray grout so it's a little bit on the edge so same thing clean put extra one but then you see late yes my friends here the grout is done you guys can see how it looks closed up very good and just need it to dry and then we're gonna do some caulking all done all good all running this is one of four of them we're just doing the last one right now nice and easy anyone can do it just have to take a little bit time and patient but uh, this job and save you money yes my friend like you can see here the grout is done nice now we just gotta clean it up and prepare for to put some uh, silicone on the corner and on the around the shower base so I'm just gonna show you guys what we look for to clean is just some dust that stay behind so what we do would be with a paper towel or a, a white cloth usually in this case I would use white because the tile are white and then we just go clean everything up make sure all the corn where you're gonna put the caulking the silicone Everything is nice and clean, up and down, both side, and uh, clean everything up. Then once it's clean, free, free of dust, and then you just uh, do the caulking on the corner and around the shower base. Like the corner, I put some, some grout in there just to fill in the, any gap and stuff, and then I put silicone right on top of it. The bottom of the shower, I leave it open and put any, any grout, because sometimes if you put grout, it would crack and make some noise, so if you leave it without grout, the silicone is not flexible enough that it moves a little bit, would not make any noise. So guys, this is about it. If you have any question, comment, let me know. We have a few more videos. If you want to see more content, just go back to those videos and watch them. They are very good videos. And if you have questions, comment. Don't be shy, just ask and make your comment. Thank you and see you soon.